Welcome to our tech tutorial. Today, we're tackling a tricky issue that many Safari users have encountered after recent updates. Our viewer is looking for a way to retrieve cached images from Safari, specifically by domain name. This was straightforward before the update to macOS 12.4 and Safari version 10.1, but now the cache structure has changed making it difficult to differentiate images by their source domain. Let's dive into the details of this challenge and explore potential solutions together. Welcome back to another technical video. Today we're gonna to be going through your question, answering it and hopefully finding that solution for you. Now, remember to stay just a little bit crazy like me, and hopefully you get to that resolution. Now let's continue on. In this video, we'll explore how to retrieve cached images from Safari after the update to version 10.1. Previously, images were stored in domain-specific folders, but now they are saved with unique identifiers. First, let's look at the old cache location. You could find images for a specific domain, like Google in this path. Tobias library cache com.apple safaris webkit cache version 9 records google.com. After the update, the cache structure changed. Now images are stored under a different string, making it difficult to identify them by domain. For example, the new path looks like this slash library caches com.apple.safari slash webkit cache slash version 9 records 1A71C2C3069617815FB52ADEB969BD3D70D. D. To differentiate images by domain, you can try using the Safari developer tools to inspect network requests. This may help you correlate cached images with their respective domains. Unfortunately, if the cache structure does not provide a direct way to link images to domains, you may need to consider alternative methods, such as maintaining a mapping of URLs to cached images in your app. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. To retrieve domain images from Safari's cache in version 10.1, first locate the history database at slash library safari slash history dot db. This database contains a table called history visits, which records the timestamps and unique IDs of visited URLs. Using the unique ID from History Visits, you can find the corresponding URL in another table named History Items. Then, check for cached images that match the timestamps recorded in the database. Keep in mind, this method is not foolproof for finding exact images related to your Safari history, but it is a workaround that may help. And that's it guys. We've gone through, found the solutions, and hopefully answered your query. If it did, please hit subscribe. I really appreciate it. And until next time, I hope you have a good one. Cheers.